Hello, amigos. Yeah, Rich and Amiga Vegas. here, and welcome back to Sonic Mania Plus. Last time we um, did Ray Story, and uh, now we're going to be playing as Mighty the Armadillo. Mm -hmm. So, let's turn this on. And uh, I have a guest commentator with me today, so would you like to introduce yourself? It's me, Tato! <laughs> I play lots of games and sometimes Sonic, very rarely, but it's pretty cool. <laughs> Uh, uh, better than Sonic. <laughs> it's not, but explain like if you want, you can like explain like your thoughts on like the Sonic series and stuff. If you want. It's more just for me. It's more like personal. I like to like explore more and stuff like that. But Sonic, you know, yeah, give one point to the other. But yeah, it's up for the adventure than the speed. I want to walk around, look at all these weird things. Like, What's that? They can still do it in Sonic, but it's not just running around. It's good to say. I think it depends on the game. If you play so, um, yeah. like Mania or Free and Knuckles or Sonic Adventure, there's a lot more reason to explore, and Sonic Unleashed to an extent. But like some of them, like colors and stuff, like there's um, there's not as much to explore. Yeah, it's the thing of what I'm a bit. But I, I do like Sonic. Yeah, it's just I prefer to explore the world of Mario. Like, even though most of it is the same now. Good. We have our own personal tastes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Mine's better like this. <laughs> yeah, it may be wrong, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Might be wrong, but we've got our own tastes. Just join that yeah. point. Could you lower the in game music a little? Okay, yeah, sure. Is it. Oh, I have gotten pause now, I think. Uh, not, not, um, not you. Um, I was reading the chat. <laughs> yeah. There we go, yeah, I, I can definitely see it. I had it bumped yeah. up a bit because, um... Because uh, Sonic Forces is a bit quiet. But yeah. Let me know yeah, how that is. It's <laughs> playing that four round. It's just, it's... What's your feelings on Forces? Sonic Forces? Um, I, I, I quite like it. Like, I don't... Hate it, and I don't think it's like <laughs> the best thing ever. But it, it seems to be the same opinion of most people. Know it. it's basically the, it's the most okay game. Yeah. It's just it's okay. It's not bad. Yeah. It's not really that good. It's, it's okay. Yeah, that's, that's kind of how I feel about it. Yeah. Like, I I can list like a million complaints, but I also can tell you that if you made me play the game then I probably wouldn't be able to stop myself from playing it, because I like it, you know? Yeah. I, when I did yeah, this... It's fun to play. I, know, I think I played it in one play for more than a few hours, and I was like, this, this is really good, but I probably won't be coming back to it, maybe. Pretty much, yeah. Because there's like better Sonic games out there. I've got to play those. Like Mania, for instance. It's really good. Mania's amazing. I think I've played through this game yeah. some... Like main story mode or whatever you want to call it, like twenty mm. something times. Really? Yeah. Okay. I've got like either seventy-five or eighty hours on the Switch version, <laughs> and oh, I've also you... I've also that's completed that's it a bunch of times on the PS4 as well. So quite, quite dedicated to it. But I guess it is more or less like Sonic. Fit. It's just like better, I guess. With upgrade. It's made by the fans as well, right? or something. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. made by, so, well, like, cool. the main guy behind it was, um, uh, like, Christian Whitehead, and he also did the ports of, like, Sonic CD, and, uh, the mobile versions of Sonic 1 and 2. Which we really, 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 really need to come on console, please. <laughs> yeah, console, please. I prefer on console than, a uh, touchpad. Not yeah, like, same. Fred made play. I haven't Especially touched them. Like I haven't yeah. touched them because they're on the phone, but... I mean, I think they've come out for free now, so I might check them out, but my phone's like memory is a bit out. Yeah, yeah Sauce is one of Matt's favourites, apparently. Yeah, it's just pretty good. But, um, how many of you played Matt? Like Sonic games, if you remember. Because I know I haven't played too many of them. I've only like lots of Red Sacks and Oh, my favourite by far. Even though it's broken, I love Adventure 2. But. Wait, I think it's more like the style reasons and showers. Adventure 2 is really, really good. I, uh, mm. I've, I've played like every single game except for Sonic Pocket Adventure, which I might actually like 
try and fix that because I should play that because that game is really good apparently. Is it? Oh, yeah. What is it, it like Game Boy Advance or something? It's for the Neo Geo Pocket Color and it's essentially oh. like um, think of Sonic Mania but made in like 1999. <laughs> oh. That's like the best way to put it. It's got like stages which were in the old games but they're kind of like remixed for a little bit. Obviously, it's not. I, w I wouldn't say it's on the same level as Mania, like from what I've seen. But oh, yeah, Mania's Mania. But like, it has like the same sort of feel. Yeah, sixty-seven Sonic. That's, that's still quite a fair amount of Sonic. I think it's probably the same amount as Mania, honestly. Mine's like adventure games, a few of the Sonic original ones, and Sacred Rings. Oh, I was yeah. I played on 06 for like 10 minutes, but then. Mm, 06. <laughs> yeah, that one wasn't very good. Let's yeah. talk about that. A lot, people, ones, you know, a lot of people didn't really like um, Secret Ring Cyber. It was alright. I kind of. It was like one of the only weekends I had. I kind of enjoyed it, but I think I was forced to enjoy it. I didn't really mind it. I didn't think it was as bad as I thought. Yeah, it's definitely playable and kind of enjoyable. I do remember, I got Matt to play like some of the classic Sonic games, like he played um, through Sonic 1, 2 and CD, and then a bit of Sonic 3. Yes. Oh, and Sonic Unleashed. Oh yeah, I've only seen stuff on there. I'm not, not really good things really. But it doesn't look too bad. It's one of my favourites. I favorites. think it's more physical Marvel thing. They're like, it's not Sonic. But I think that's kind of the point, it's also a bit different. Yeah. I mean, I, I, um, it just felt like really, it felt like the series was actually like still good after I thought that it was like terrible because I didn't actually like it after, I didn't really like Sonic after I played Sonic 06 and I sold like all my Sonic games. So. Oh, damn, really? Yeah. Like Sonic Knockdown. <laughs> oh, damn. And then like, um, when Unleashed came out, no, it was when Black Knight came out, I started to like Sonic a bit more again. And then I played Unleashed and I was like, yeah, this is like, this is still good. So I kind of like bought all the Sonic games I had again, even 06. Yeah, I see. But, yeah, I think I'm... Yeah, I've been playing it for a little bit and thought, mm, I, don't know, I don't have to play it. These special stages like can be a bit annoying sometimes. <laughs> Yeah, I think it was in that for a little while, weren't it? Oh, that's... It stopped me a little bit. I don't mind, that's not the best. Yeah, you are cutting out like a tiny bit. Yeah. I mean, they can play out quite a bit, especially when you're like, like overheats and stuff. Yeah. At the moment, I can hear thunder, and I know there's thunder, there's probably thunder near Taylor as well. <laughs> so there yeah, might be some issues because of that. Yeah. I'm feeling the power cuts. It's, 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 that'll be nice. Yeah, but I'm playing on Switch, you know, I can play it in handheld mode. Oh. I can't stream in handheld yes. mode, unfortunately. Oh, I can't. <laughs> I, if I could, then I would, because I prefer playing my Switch in handheld mode. That's fair enough. I'm kind of like a bit more. Yeah. But the handheld mode is probably the, the best use. Especially in this weather, so, so, because I like to sit down the stairs and play my Switch. Yeah, I wouldn't mind sitting outside and playing it yourself instead. Yeah, that'd be nice. Just um, instead of being one and hot, you'd be like, oh, that's nice. Slightly less hot. <laughs> Depends though, because sometimes it feels even hotter outside. Yeah. You're just a whole lot. We've had rain, we've had a bit of fun, just that's... that's... I'm fine with that. It's a good start. <laughs> Oh, I've got to put my clothes on. What one of these things in the uh, fact? I've got these two. Wait, what's that? Uh, in those moving platforms. Yeah. I, like, I went down one of the ramps and I flew into one as soon as it hit in the wall and I just died. So... Wow. What level are you on? Uh, on the factory one. One with the water. In the, uh, oh, hydro you say. Uh, might be. I don't know by name. I, I managed to get the secret ring that I uh, missed by accident on my um, Sonic and Tails playthrough. Because I, 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 knew, I, knew, I knew it was there, I just sped through the level so fast I forgot about it. 
Oh, too much speed. <laughs> yep. So now it's like a matter of remembering the um to get the other ones because there's one in chemical plant that I sometimes forget about, but I can at least restart easily to retry for that. And um, whether or not I fail special more. stage six because <laughs> that one's the yeah. hardest one in my opinion. If you fail them, is that kind of it for nah. that thing? Or... If you find another special stage ring, then it takes you back to the last one you tried. Yeah, I see. So it's very you have like two lives to a little bit, or no? Nah, you as long as you find a special stage ring, then you can just retry the same special stage that you did last time. Oh, you sorry. just have you just have to find another ring though. Yeah. So I think it's quite a few per level or something. Yeah, there's loads. Like, I haven't even found all of them, and I know where, like, 20 of them are. Really? Yeah. Same with Sonic 3 and Knuckles, because Sonic 3 and Knuckles had the same thing. Yeah. Ouch. This is good, this. It doesn't punish you too much for favorite. Yeah. So, I, I, this is probably my favorite way of getting two special stages, to be honest. It's like, the Sonic series has always had, like, weird different ways of getting special stages. Like, Sonic 1's was like, collect 50 rings and reach the end, which was okay. Oh yeah, I still like that one. Sonic um, 2's was get 50 rings and reach a checkpoint, and then the stars that go above the checkpoint. Oh, that was Sonic 2. Yeah. Um, Sonic 3 and Sonic Mania did hold that over, but they didn't use that for Chaos Animal Special Stages. They used that for, like, the Blue Spheres. Not, well, Blue Spheres and Mania, and... Um, some like mm -hmm. uh, mini games to give you power ups in Sonic 3 and Knuckles and whatnot. Uh, then Sonic 3 and Knuckles was you have to find the the little rings like you do in Mania. Yeah. Uh, find then like just... yeah. yeah. Then like Sonic Heroes was like collect the key in a stage and then don't get hit while you have the key. I don't like the sound of that one. <laughs> It's it's a bit easier than it sounds, if especially if you're playing as like Team Rose, or if you've played the game as many times as I have. But yeah, I've, I've been playing it. Have you not? Wow, that's surprising, isn't it? That seems to be like the one sort of game like everyone has played. Like really? Yeah, from like what I've only I played it a little. Oh, okay, you've at least played a little, played a little bit. Mm -hmm. Hello, uh, Rose Rose Co animates. I hope I said your first name right. <laughs> oh, hello! Uh, we have another fellow animator here, Taylor. <laughs> hello! I haven't animated in freaking ages. Like forever, really. It's mostly because my computers haven't been the best. It's been like, oh, alright. Ah, uh, so would you actually go back to doing it if, like, you um, had the better computer then? Uh, yeah, I've actually recently, like, what, three weeks ago, got a really good one. I've been thinking about oh, doing yeah. it again, but it's just kind of getting motivated into it again. After yeah, I all that time, it's like, like three, three years of it. Oh, if you get motivated into it again, then, like, you know, definitely, like, let us know. What's, what's... It's me and, like, the other people of college and stuff really likes the animations. Yeah. Ross. Know, like, Zen, Co. Like, Thirteen. Okay, Ross. So, Co. I remember always looking at him thinking like, yeah, it could be that, oh. yeah. God damn it. Did I not wear it? I think we'll level up you, but I haven't done any of the sequel no, rings yet. Let's just restart. So I looked at the chat and then I'd like, because the game plays itself sometimes. Yeah, then... you can just kind of like look away for a bit. <laughs> um, oh, Matthew Lay asks, um, what stuff do you um, animate? Uh, what do I? Oh yeah. Well, a while ago I used to animate kind of just what I liked really. Yeah. It's kind of like the Pokemon one, uh, a few just random ones, almost like a green trip, and a few others. But the thing is, though, is when I look back at them, I'm kind of like, a bit. I don't like because it's kind of like it's got my voice in it, and I'm trying to like do different voices and that, but I'm not a. Not a Expressive vocal person. So that's ah. hard. Uh, so just looking back at him, I'm kind of like, eh, is that cool? <laughs> not, not really my thing. Oh, I mean, it's all, we all start like, somewhere. Yeah. Uh, do you do you watch yeah. um someone on YouTube called Some Comedy Johnny? Uh, 
I recognize the name. Because um, he um, he's a reviewer, but he also does like let's plays on like other channels and stuff. Um, mm -hmm. But he does a lot of like, well, he used to do quite a few Sonic animations and a couple of other animations. Um, but the main ones that come to my mind is he did like a um, Q and A thing where he'd have like himself talk to like the Sonic characters and they'd like answer, but it'd be like more of like a comedic thing. And if I remember correctly, the first one he did, a lot of the voices were like him. He did have some other people, but um, yeah, a lot of the voices um, he did himself. Oh, this is pretty cool. Uh, and then the second one he did, he hired like a lot of other people. Yeah, I think if I was in the dirt game, I'd probably do that. Get other people to do it. That can kind of express their voice more than just me. Because <laughs> obviously, having a lot more vocal range is better than just one voice. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. It's, it would be pretty cool to do it again. Yeah, I, I think you should um, go for it again. Oh, wait, no, I want to go down here. Yeah, I can always download like, Flash again. And just give it a little try at least. See yeah. if I can still do it. <laughs> After all this time. I'm an old man now. It's been years. I'm sure like it'll come back to you like as like second nature or something. To be honest. Yeah. Once you I'm get just, like, used to it. Stop it like... Depending on all this amazing stuff coming up like, oh. <laughs> the, the one animation I remember the most is like one where you did like a seagull or something. Oh, I have a Pokemon. Yeah, I oh, was at um, Wingo then. I remember, I remember. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be Wingo. Flies over and like more or less like that exactly. That's the nice of it. Yeah, that's the one I remember the most. Mm. It might have been one of the first ones I saw you do though, to be fair. I, re I started in like the third um, level. And I think was you with um, Matt? Um, oh, yeah, I was with Matt and Kieran in level 2 before we went to level. Yeah. Was that you and that? some of the bits. Uh, and I remember they played one of the big screen during one of the parent events, I think, and I was like, oh my god, I can't believe Why would they do this to me? <laughs> <laughs> so it's even with the, it's my voices and everything, so like, it was like one minute, it's just a loop of me continuously talking with some meh animation backwards. Oh, no. I that thought your animation was um, pretty good. Yeah, it's it's alright. It could be improved a lot. That's oh yeah, but I've, I mean, I feel like um, a lot of people would say that about their own stuff, you know? Yeah, you always see like the bad side of it rather than the good. Yeah. Like, I could do this now, I could do that now. Probably won't, but I could do it. I'm happy I got Special Stage 6 on my first try. That's the hardest one in my opinion. Just yeah, so as long as what, I don't are mess they random, up. the stages? Uh, no, they, they're all in a set order, and they get a bit harder each time. And then, yeah. oh, why did I do that? It doesn't matter. I thought it was one per uh, level. No. That's pretty cool to know. So, well, um, so like the first Chaos Emeralds, that special stage will always be the same special stage. Unless yeah. you're playing Encore mode, it has its own version in there. But every special stage will be like, they all have their own unique special stage. Every Chaos Emerald has their own unique special stage. There we go, that's the best uh. one for it. Yeah, so it's not level, it's a uh, similar. Yeah. Oh, I'm on the meme machine, but sweet. <laughs> I won't fail there. Oh, you're wearing, you were in Chemical Plant. <laughs> I said Hydro City Zone. Yeah. Because you said water, oh, and well. I, I immediately thought Hydro City. <laughs> I don't even know if that was in this recording yeah. or if that was in the one where he fouled. Oh, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna cut this, cut all that out, but. Like, for anybody like watching this and didn't, doesn't know, I, I re-recorded for like five minutes and we didn't have any gameplay on screen. <laughs> yeah, it was the title. It's like, oh, okay. Enjoy uh, this lovely screen. The song crew. So I'm like one wow. stage behind you then. I'm on, well, I'm just yeah. about to get to Act 2 of Chemical Plant now. Yeah, just boss that really quickly, like, much quicker than me. 
I haven't done any of the uh, Chaos Emeralds, so I haven't had to use the Ah, okay. Are you, who are you playing as? Uh, I was playing as Knuckles for a bit, I just found Knuckles as randomly. Oh yeah, you're playing Encore mode, aren't you? Yeah. So, so you also started... Right in there. So you also started on Angel Island as well, like, to actually playing Angel Island. Yeah. Whereas I started straight off um, Green Hill, Angel Island was just a cutscene. So I don't know how much I've added on the I mean I can I can tell you like the gist of it if you want me to. So um, obviously Angel Island you can play like a little bit of that, not too much, but just like a little bit. Um, mm. the special stages like the ones where you hit the um the, you get a certain amount of rings and then you hit the um, checkpoints are pinball stages. Um, the special stages oh, yeah. are like a lot harder than what they are in Mania mode, the ones we get the Chaos Emeralds. Yeah. And but the level really design easy. and the colour palette is a little bit different in the levels. Um, no, 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 it's, like, it's slightly different but makes it seem like... Okay. Yeah, I believe a lot. it's a lot more like at night time in Encore mode compared to Mania mode. Um, and uh, Mirage Saloon, the one where you're in the, the plane, Act 1, uh, you're not in a plane in Encore mode. Oh really? Yeah. Did you get a plane? Uh, in, um, it's, it's, all right, it's, it's more or less like you had to go at the same speed as the screen. Yeah, spell, like, so. screw your speed. Okay. Yeah, so you took that out of Encore mode and it's an entirely new stage. Oh, sweet. Oh, cool. uh, you also, you, um, you don't have the, um, the, the final final boss in that game. You know how you like they usually have like a supersonic boss. Yeah, he's well. not in um, encore mode. It's just the normal final boss. Oh, good. Oh. And obviously you get like your mighty and rays. Well, yeah, like, join you randomly. So the um the new like mechanic is like you have like two characters out at the same time. The question mark um mm. like well. Before I explain the question mark, actually, you have little monitors that um, have characters' heads on them, and that lets you play as oh. like you you add them to the bottom. Yeah. You don't have That's lives. Right, yeah. you, it's like have you played? Oh. You've, you've played Castlevania, not Castlevania, um, Bloodstained, right? Oh, I haven't actually. No. Do you know how the game works? So you have four characters, and once all of them die, then you lose instead of having oh. lives. Similar to Smash Bros. campaign. Yeah, yeah, it is similar to that, yeah. yeah, yeah. So you don't get a game over until you mighty, lose but... all your characters. But you can also get your characters back by breaking TVs with their faces, or if you go to the special stages with the checkpoints. And mm -hmm. um, those special stages, do you know the crane game, um, game I mentioned? So it's similar yeah. to Knuckles Chaos X. Um, you think you have that, and you can get your characters back using that. Uh, you sweet. can, if you press the X button, you can swap between you and your partner. Oh, that's really. That's and um, if you get a question mark box, then uh, you, you, it does like a random swap between any of the characters in your party. I'm just mm. gonna call it a party because it's RPGs. <laughs> <laughs> and Sonic RPG, my favorite. My fuck that game. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, if you get, uh, I think it's like a weird like orange and blue arrow box, I can't really explain it very well. But it's something yeah. similar to that. Then, um, then it, it swaps your first character with whatever the first letter is at the bottom left. So, so, so you know how it says like S, M, K, stuff like that. Like you have letters. So if the first one says S and you hit one of those orange and blue arrow boxes, then your main character will swap to Sonic instead. That sounds pretty cool. I do, I do kind of wish you could just swap to like everyone on the fly, but... Yeah, I am thinking I'd rather have that. Didn't know I Yeah, but maybe in... Oh, that was a bit silly, I should have done this one. But maybe like in an update they could change that, or in a Mania yeah. 2, which I would really like. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't mind that. Or more DLC. One, two, one. It's first DLC. If, if they added like more stuff to Mania, or if they made another Mania, what would you want? 
I'm way too sure, I guess. Maybe... No, I wouldn't say more of the same. Maybe do it with the 3D Sonic. I don't really like the 3D Sonic's too much. Well, assuming that it would be, like, still 2D and everything. Yeah, some 2D stuff. Uh, I guess more or less just... My character's definitely... Like, Big the Cat. I'd love to be Big the Cat. He's, he's my favourite character. Yeah. I'd love to have him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, like, it's, it's just more characters, more stages. I'm just a massive DLC pack, I guess. Just more uh, items and stuff. Fair more throwbacks. I don't know if they can be made to be able to add to that. Oh, Sonic's in. I feel, I feel like if they make another Mania, they should have it so all the stages are like um, new. Because like they reuse a yeah, lot of stages from the old games. I feel like they should make a lot of new stages. Mm, I it's and, half of the Mania. Yeah, there's only four new stages. And then... Yeah, I got a nice combo though. That was intentional. I, I told you guys that I would actually do a good combo at one, one point. Uh, you did it, it was amazing. <laughs> oh, you're on the main beam bit. Hello, Ultra Instinct Sonic, how's it going? Um, oh, I'd also like more playable characters, so like... I, I, I don't mean like they have to add them like anytime soon, maybe like in a Mania 2 or something. I definitely want to play as Amy, like, have the classic Amy, because she used to have an older design. And in Sonic Advance, yeah. she had her own unique moveset, where, like, you, if you, when she jumped, she doesn't, like, roll into a ball and stuff. Like, she had, um, you have to actually, like, there's a separate button that attacks, and you have to use that instead. Like, it was very different oh, to the other characters. Good. I feel like that would so be good. I imagine it was a hammer or something. Like. Yeah, it was a hammer. Yeah. Or was it still ball? Uh, um, and uh, you can also do like tricks and stuff. Like in Sonic Adventure, especially, if you ran and then you press the hammer button, she it, the hammer would bounce from the ground and then it flip you up in the air and she does like loads of tricks. Oh, that sounds pretty. Cool. Yeah. Well, something like that. Maybe like using the uh, hammer, give you a bit of momentum or something. Yeah, like, yeah. Spinning yeah. it to go a bit faster and stuff. Yeah, that, that's, I mean, that's kind of what it um, does in a way. Um, I'd also like to have um, Team Chaotix back. Um, Would you? Yeah, um, in <laughs> Knuckles Chaotix, they already had, like, um, stuff, like, unique stuff they could do. Like, Vector could double jump. Um, SBO, um, he would, uh, you could run upside down on walls. Yeah. Uh, Charmy, he could like fly infinitely. I think they'd have to change that to be honest. I think that was a bit yeah. boring. But I think, like, more or less, fitting characters need to be like one game mechanic that like, makes them completely different. Similar to like this one. Well, yeah. Has, like, one game mechanic that makes them completely different. Like, Gray's flying! I freaking love that so much. Yeah, I yeah. I just died forever. Damn. Okay, I died there. Yeah. <laughs> I, I got to the boss where you're like, where he's in like playing, like, following. I don't know if I was paying too much attention, I should just drive. Oh, is that the one where you chase after him? Yeah. Oh, I'm going to be, I'm gonna gonna be doing him way. soon. But all I need to do is hold right it's because I'm time. turned into Super Mighty. <laughs> when I'm invincible. Uh, yeah, because uh, when you get out of the Chaos Emerald, you turn Super. Yeah, that's a pretty good skill, isn't it? Invincible Super. I'm not going to This one's a little bit like iffy, to be honest. It can be a bit. Especially like, um. Uh. The, um are you trying to jump into the missiles? Like the blue one? Oh no, I, I, I was at first. But I was supposed to pay too much attention. I just wanted to get But like, I got a game over, I think. Ah. Because, um. um do, do you have flyers in this? Or is it straight up just like the character? I think that's what it was. Uh, wait, what? Is it, is it lives or is it just characters? Because I ran out of all my characters and I think it, instead of him with that to check, it's yeah, just it's, it's just characters. 
So you get you have to get a continue if you want to like restart like normally. Um, yes, you, you, just, um, you, if you hit the blue one, the blue missile, it goes back to him. But usually, like a lot of some people I see jump into it. If you just roll on the ground, it's a lot easier. I don't know that. <laughs> I just jumped into it. How far are you on like mania mode? Have you finished the game? I think, yeah, I finished mania. Like, oh, cool. That like just I Sonic the Tales? Uh, I think it was. Yeah, just grab that. I didn't like Knuckles too much. He's a bit slower, like quite a bit slower. So I th I th like five more and it's just a bit. Mm. So I thought you would have liked Knuckles because it's like his more ex is more based on exploration. Yeah, I should like him more. <laughs> but it's just, it seems a bit slower. And, uh, I like to collect every ring, even though I, it's one I can't really like dodge. So I think someone like you might be able to dodge it quite. Well. Yeah. I, I just have to. I've got to collect it all. I've got to collect them all, man. Yeah. Gotta catch him. Gotta catch him. Gotta catch him, man. Yeah. Gotta catch him, man. I'm trying to get in Pokemon, but like, it's really hard. Some of my event ones, you know, all this stuff is really hard to get. And you've got to trade with other people or buy another game. Just to get a certain Pokemon. Uh, have you not completed the Pokedex? Taylor. And I, oh, I haven't got any characters at the moment, it's just me, or just Sonic. Can you hear me, Taylor? I should be trying to get to Taylor! <laughs> Probably just Sonic in my Sonic game. Taylor? Mm -hmm. Taylor. So okay, I think you're lagging out a bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'm lagging a bit. I'm yeah, because you couldn't hear anything I was saying and I asked you something and yeah. <laughs> oh, oh are, you, are you trying to ask? Yeah, I can't even remember what I was going to ask you now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think my internet's a bit uh, enough. Yeah, it's, going, it's a bit better. What are you now. trying to say? I can't remember. <laughs> Google says the above comments is high. Hello! Gotta go fast. Hi, Will. <laughs> Comment box is Oh, that one. Yes, thank you, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm now translator. With these now. Thanks, man. No, Matt's good like that. He translated like some other comments. Like I usually get Spanish comments because my name has the word amigo in it. Uh, uh yeah. Well, look at this guy. Two more rings. Yeah, I'm super <laughs> right. Look how fast you're going. That's insane. Bear in mind, I've played this game a lot. <laughs> Not so much. It's fine. About, um... Too, too much trying to collect everything. About, uh, Sonic, like, Mania Adventures. Like, did you want to say, like, what you think of that? Sonic Mania Adventures? Yeah, the cartoon. Oh, well, two adventure games, just like, put into one, like, awesome game. That would be pretty cool. I would definitely like that. No, I mean the cartoon. Oh, it's oh, that one! That was Avengers. It's yeah. Like, it's Mania. Because that was just really funny. It reminded me kind of Tom and Jerry. It does, yeah. It's great. Um, it's yeah. The song. Do you have a favourite episode? Hmm? Or have you watched it? All? I have, yeah. What's I your favourite one? one? Ending is probably the best part. It's just so good. Did you say the ending one? Yeah, yeah, the ending where well, like, it's just, after everything they do, knuckles. <laughs> yes! It's just knuckles. It's the best one. It's, it's fun. It's so like funny. Oh, actually, my favourite is um, the third one. Where the first one where you see knuckles. No, the first time you see knuckles, and the first time you see Ray. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I like Ray. Especially with Mighty as well. Trying to like, comes in one. <laughs> yeah. But I just love the um, the uh, knuckles um, throwing my, um, Ray away. <laughs> yeah, it's a script. Get away from my freaking ass. Oh, I died again. I'm not collecting the characters. I'm collecting all the coins, but I'm not collecting the characters. They're not coins. This isn't Mario. This isn't Mario. This is the inferior Mario. This is Mario. a good game. <laughs> good. It's actually really good. 
Yeah. Speaking of Mario, um, Will says, yeah. hey, it's Bowser. <laughs> B Bowser? Wait, Bowser? Hi, Alexi, um, Koto Fe. It's Bowser. I know it's been like four levels, well three levels and we're on the fourth level, but I'm going to quickly explain how Mighty works. So Mighty has like a little ground pound stomp and it actually does like the little um little puff of air that goes around it actually causes damage to enemies as well, it's not just what you land on. Um, when you when you jump um, or roll while he's in ball mode, he's invincible um, against spikes. He can't get hurt by them at all, and oh, really? uh, he can deflect projectiles as well. Mighty is pretty much like easy mode. Yeah, I just thought he had ground pound. The uh, so. With like um, like the ground pound as well, the icicles in uh, you know Press Garden, the one that's like oh, has a so. snow yeah. level as the second or ice as like oh. the second part of the level. Yeah. Uh, you can break yeah. the um, the ice uh, when you ground yeah. pound with the, like the spikes that are icy. You can break it's them with, long, with um, Mighty. This is pretty good. Very very good. Yeah, he's a pretty cool character. I haven't really played him much. Because I, I literally just thought it was a ground pound. And I was like, eh, it's alright, but there was other stuff as well, but it's pretty cool. Yeah, he's, prob he's probably like my favourite to play as casually. Yeah, because it seems really easy. This is like invincible games. Yeah. And like, I especially like, I like to rush through the game. And a lot of the time, like, there, well, there are times where I will bump into a spike or something. There's not non-existent mm. of that. Uh, Will asks if happens. Taylor's playing too. Taylor is playing. Um, oh yeah. You was playing yeah, encore mode. I'm, what I'm are you playing, playing now? I'm on an encore mode still. Oh yeah. Oh, no. Does it take I, you I'm back to Act Two if you get a game over or Act One? I never got a game over in this game, so I don't know. Uh, uh, yeah, it, it takes you back by a bit. And act I've, I've the first like, act, twice. yeah. I'm okay. not actually finding any Garrett to play my TV. So oh, it's okay. just Sonic at the moment. Just a little Sonic dying. I could get into the boss, but I'm, I'm quite bad at those I mean, I would say try and get 50 rings and then hit one of those checkpoints. If you're good enough for the crane game, then you'll be able to get, um... Uh... The characters like back. Characters, yeah. yeah. You, you, it's possible to get all of your characters back in just one, um... Ooh, really? One uh, bonus, yeah, one. Like you have to, like uh, you have to keep going back up to the crane game, but as long as you can keep getting up, then you can like make it. Oh, uh, get all of them. Here's a little crane game. Yeah. Okay. Like what's on? Do I choose? I choose. So you can kind of control the crane, and if you press the down button on the D-pad, it goes down. If the timing is a bit iffy at first, you kind of get used to it. Yeah, I'd like, I'm pretty sure I just got like Ray, but I think I think I might have been slightly off or something. Ah, okay. But you yeah, know, that was cool. Oh, you might you might be able to try again if you don't get to the bottom though. Right? You Oops. hit back up to the top. Oh yeah. That's what I meant I about. Just, like, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think it'd give me another shot. And that's what I meant about in like infinite retries. It gets a bit higher every time you try it, but Oh yeah. yeah. Like that's how you get like seek primes and stuff, ain't it? Like after you complete a level. Yeah. You yeah. Like, hit the bottom of the side. Yeah. yeah, and you can get like extra power-ups and stuff. How you, uh, that would actually be helpful that, like... actually, because I mean I don't I don't I, I don't know if you'd know where any of the TVs are, but you might find the one that has a character in it. That would be quite handy. Yeah. I'm actually gonna, um, I'm hoping in this stage I might actually be able to show off a glitch. Like, after I read the boss. I'm <laughs> for a glitch in my Sonic. Never. Well, they don't exist. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Sonic yeah, games are perfect. Sorry. It's Sonic not... Six, like, my favourite perfect game. <laughs> the game's meant to run as it is. So. 
<laughs> yeah, the characters are running, it's perfect, right? Yeah, see? We're just running up here, perfectly fine. It's just showing off a different pathway at the moment than to what I did on the previous streams, which is kind of cool, I guess. Yeah, that's not too dark. That's what it's quite heavily. It seems the high one of the B one. Yes. Uh, don't like specifically say Sonic, Sonic though, because that doesn't that doesn't count if you play Sonic Forces. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, true. Mario Odyssey. I'm only just reading some of these now. You want Mario Odyssey? It was amazing. It's like one. Ray, I got Ray. I was, I was thinking about, and this is only thinking at the moment because I've got other games that I want to do for streams, but I may end up doing Sonic. Mario Odyssey, I was about to call it Sonic Odyssey, Sonic for, a, Odyssey. for a stream, because I've, I've only played it. that game for two hours and I got bored. Really? And yeah, so I want to like, if I have, if I do a stream then I'll feel more inclined to want to like finish it maybe. Yeah, try it out and see people's opinions on it and be like, I oh, guess I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if I have like a chat with me and like, maybe a co-commentator as well, I'd, I'd be a bit more like, it'd feel a bit more like interesting for me. Yeah, so maybe it's just, it's not maybe your type of game, it's like kind of a collector font but a really fun one. Yeah, I'm, I don't mind collector fonts, but I prefer, like it's way too open and it feels like there's not that much to do. Really? I want to split opposite it, because most open world games usually do it. Mario obviously is that like perfect with it, there's a lot to do with a small area. I think it's like... Uh, I'm not, I'm not going to go too much on a tangent about it. <laughs> yeah, I, I know you're not the biggest fan of the Maria. 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 I, like, I like Maria, I like Sonic Adventure yeah. too. <laughs> it's supposed to be Maria, my favourite character. Her anime eyes character. and Shadow the Hedgehog. Yeah. Well, I love when she gets shot in the face, my favourite. Will says Mario Odyssey, yes. Okay, maybe I should start with Sunshine first, because I prefer that one. Okay, I can try oh, to... Sunshine. I didn't manage to do the glitch. Maybe I did it the wrong way. If you play as Mighty, and you go on the top of the capsule, and you know when, like, you're on the edge, you, like, it kind of hangs off a bit? If mm. you, um, if you do that, um, then when he gets to his little animation, apparently he, um, glitches and flicks all the way to the left of the screen or something. Oh. That's a bit weird. <laughs> it's got yeah, like it charging up a thing, even though it's not. Something like that. Yeah, kind of. It's weird. No, no, no. I keep hitting the freaking, like... The, the collector in me is like, hit every single TV and there's so many freaking, like... I should stop. Speaking so of, something I'm going to explain on screen now. There are these boxes in Press Garden. I just broke two of them. And they were... they were. I'm pretty sure they were impossible to break. Until this, um, yeah. DLC. Because you can only break them with Mighty, as far as I know. Oh, really? So yeah. like, not with like, knuckles or anything else? Yeah. So they have like TVs in them, but you can never get them. Oh. And now you can. Really weird. So because of that, yeah. I kind of feel like they plan to have Mighty in like all along, and Ray. They might have. But maybe Ray not as I'm much, never... but Mighty, like because of the thing that I just explained. Hmm. So I've never heard of these characters before. They're like more obscure ones, aren't they? Yeah, okay, but Ray's only been in one game and Mike's been in two. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. One well, boss again. I can do it this time. I believe me, just pay attention. There's an arcade game that you control with a trackball. And mm -hmm. um, it's like in an isometric view. And uh, it's called yeah. like Sega Sonic the Hedgehog. And the main characters are Sonic, yeah. Mighty, and Ray. And then oh. that was the last time you saw Ray. And then after that, you saw Mighty again in Knuckles Chaotix. And basically, Mighty in that game was basically Sonic. Mm -hmm. He controlled exactly like uh -oh. Sonic. The only difference is, is I think he had like a little wall jump. But aside from that, he was just Sonic. Because Sonic wasn't mm -hmm. actually in Knuckles Chaotix. He was, well, he was in the ending. Because I think yeah. he comes in with Tails on his plane. But he wasn't actually in mm -hmm. the game to play as, so. Good old Tails is playing. Has he even got a license? How old is Tails? Um, twelve. <laughs> oh, twelve for your pilot. It's fine. Um, um, I, I'll ask you something. Did you know that that plane isn't actually Tails' plane? Isn't it? <laughs> no, it's not. It? 
Oh, but sorry, 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 doesn't want to go in it. It's not too powerful, but... No, he does go in it sometimes. Like, if, like at the beginning of this playthrough, he went in it. He flew mighty to the um, island. Because um, it has Sonic's <laughs> name. Of... Sonic's name is on the plane. Uh, maybe you can tell us like Sonic that much. So, whatever. <laughs> Love you, Sonic. But in um, Sonic um, Adventure... Uh, in Sonic Adventure... Um, he uses his own plane. Yeah, so he like literally customizes himself and puts the emerald in the propeller bit. Yeah. Something like that. Um, I'm trying to remember correct. No, I, th I think um, no, he uses his own plane at the beginning. You know, when he crashes near the beach, Emerald Coast. Oh yeah. And like then the after that, he uses Sonic's plane. Because I remember Sonic mm. um, says, "Why not use my plane, the tornado or something." And then he edits that with the Chaos Emeralds, I think. Yeah. Been a while. I'm gonna have to play Sonic Adventure for a stream because that's like one of my favorite Sonic games. Yeah. I, just, I love playing I through Sonic Story. Well. What was that, sorry? It seems like it's like you go to your thing, yeah. <laughs> I, I usually, um, like, I, I like to play um, Sonic Story, um, like, just Sonic Story a lot of the time, and then just see how fast I can play through it, because I can beat Sonic Story in like 50 minutes. Oh, okay. yeah. What the whole game? Uh, the whole of Sonic Story. So, have you played Sonic Adventure before? Sonic Story, oh, excuse me, I thought you meant but yeah, Sonic Story and Sonic Adventure. Yeah. I've played it, but I don't remember too much of it. Really. Okay. It's like, it's alright. There's like, um, so you have like different stories, like each character. Yeah. And, um, but yeah, one of those. one. <laughs> yep. I don't really mind Big's one, to be honest. I really hate it. It's the only one I haven't done because I'm just like, I can't do it. I, I got stuck on it for ages when I was younger. Did you? Yeah. I think I'm still stuck on it now. I did, um, I did like all the characters' stories, and then I got to Big, then I got stuck. So then I went straight to um, Dammer's story, and then I will try to go back to Big, and I was still stuck. And then I asked my friend to come around, and he was like, "I've done this before, but I have no idea how you do this." And then I like, eventually, um, I had one of my friends around, and I did it, and I was like, "Oh my god!" And then after I got to like the final story, and I saw Super Sonic, and I was just like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> oh my god! Whoa. All this stuff I've never been able to do before because of Big the freak cat. Yeah. I've never even done Sonic Story, well, no, Sonic, uh, Super Sonic Story. It was really big, it's locked me off. That was like one of the most satisfying things like ever for me. I think that might have been the very first time I saw Super Sonic actually. Damn it, I'm really? used, I got rid of my fire shield and used a normal shield. Cause... Oh, that's... I think, does the normal shield even double jump with it? The electric shield lets you double jump if you play as Sonic. Oh, I need Sonic. Yeah. Okay. Because he doesn't have, well, he has the drop dash ability, but he doesn't really have a proper ability like flying or something, so. Yeah. Um, dash, which I absolutely love, and Sonic always needs this Because like, I've, 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 um, I've played like Sonic um, 2, 1, and 3, I don't know why I said it in that order. And, um, and I, I never got Super Sonic when I played through those games, like before I played Sonic Adventure. Then I played Sonic Heroes, but I could never finish Team Dark and Team Chaotix. And um, so I never reached the Super Sonic ending. And then I played... It's me as well, but Team Dark is a bit hard. <laughs> I can do it easily now, it's just when I was younger. And also I played on the PS2, and the PS2 runs at like 15 frames per second. <laughs> yeah, the PS2 version of Sonic Heroes is awful. Um, I thought it was a game you exclusive, or I didn't know it was on PS2. I was on PS2, GameCube, Xbox, and PC. Oh, damn, that's a good. Yeah, it was the first like, multi-platform Sonic game. Um, then I played Sonic Adventure 2 before Sonic Adventure, but I got stuck on... Um, uh, you know, um, the... have you finished Sonic Adventure 2? Yeah, I think it's interesting. Quite a bit. The last stage where um, you play as like all the characters and you take it in turns. I got stuck oh, as yeah, Knuckles that... for ages because I didn't have the air necklace. Mm, I did eventually do it, thing. but I didn't do it until after I beat. Yeah, 
I, I did it without the air necklace, but I could, it took me like until after I beat Sonic Adventure 1. Um, I also played Shadow the Hedgehog before I played Sonic Adventure 1, and, but I never got very far. Did you? Yeah. Um, I remember liking it was a little, I played it like recently. So you like it's, I feel it's like I liked bad, it. But like, yeah. I feel like I liked it when <laughs> I was younger. <laughs> yeah, I thought, I was like, it's really cool, wow, what's that? It's got guns. That's, like, that's what Sonic's always needed, right? Like, I never really started have, on that. It didn't really add much to it, did it? It actually yeah. added quite a bit, like, that was actually like the best part of the game. <laughs> really, the guns? Yeah, yeah like, it's it, yeah. Because like... the, they actually worked. <laughs> yeah, the rest yeah. of the game didn't. <laughs> It was a bit. Yeah. So I do remember getting all the endings. It kind of annoyed me there was a final ending. Like, getting like yeah. different endings. That was really annoying as well. Oh, can I do it again? Yeah. No, I can't. Yes, I did the glitch! I went flying off the side of the thing. You'll see it, Ooh, like, yes. on the playback. I did it, like, unintentionally. I was about to try it, and then it just did it. Yes. Um, the reason I said don't get started on that is because when um, I first saw the advertisement for Shadow the Hedgehog, my mum was like, oh wow, Sonic has a gun. <laughs> yeah, Sonic's a gun, wow. He's, he's a prince and teenage or I was like, no mum, that's Shadow. And she's like, who's Shadow? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Sonic Fetch 2 again. It's Sonic! It's not Sonic. It's Sonic. What, have <laughs> what have they done to Sonic? Yeah. We've done a change, just come and give him a cut. Goodness, this is a terrible need this guy. <laughs> Big the cat for president. Big the cat would be a better president than the actual president in Sonic, so yeah. Yeah. The weird one that seems to love Sonic a lot because there's a picture next to it of freaking Sonic and Shepard. I don't know how we got that picture. <laughs> yeah, this is like, okay. Why have you done that? Like, he must have taken it between Sonic Heroes and Shadow of the Hedgehog. Because it... Yeah. But, like, well, between CIA those... Yeah. They could have at least, I don't know. Like, I was gonna say maybe have something with, like, all the characters at the end with the Metal Overlord or something from Sonic Heroes, but... Then you'd question uh, where the president was in that game, because Sonic Heroes, for the better, didn't have any humans. Oh really? Yeah. Except, or, unless, you, on the... unless you count Eggman. Well, I don't count Eggman. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's not human. He's, yeah. like... <gasps> I'm playing freaking that level we've been trying to do one. Destroyed me, yeah, and everyone else. Special that level stage, last... your uh, fine battery? The, the one with Ray, with my record. Where you're literally oh, record on the fine battery, yeah. With Ray, yeah. I went, when you sent in the chat that you beat my record, I thought you was joking, and I noticed you weren't joking, oh. and I actually got a bit salty, but then I played the level even more, and I think you was the reason why I wanted to get first place anyway, so, thank mm. you. <laughs> That's alright, it's pretty cool, it's like, I remember seeing your thing, not because like, you did it first time, I was like, yeah, I did it, I was like, I could do this, I could do that, I could do that, and I eventually tried it, and then I was like, yay. <laughs> and then you just destroyed me like, oh, and everyone else in the Have, like, have you tried, you um... So you know you're playing the Encore mode at that stage. Um, you what? can actually play that in, um... So you're playing Encore mode, and you're playing mm. the Flying Battery stage. The level layout is like, it's the same, but like, there's just a couple of different enemy placements and stuff. I actually tried doing that for like, the time trials as well. I've got it on stream. And it took me like 20 minutes to get first place on that. <laughs> really? Yeah. Wow. I just, I still need... There's like very small differences. Yeah. Small ones, but at least it's not that big. In some places, I some feel like the differences are better. Like, I feel like they improved the level design and made it easier when it's supposed to be harder. It's weird. Yeah. It's just... It's strange what we did. But, fun. A bit of variation is quite nice. It's more like in games like, um... Have you ever played Dark Souls? I've played one yes, too, but Dark Souls played the two. first one. Uh, so then in the second one, after you completed it, there's like a mode afterwards, and like, the entire game kind of changes, because there's so many new enemies and so many new things. Is that like, like the new game plus? Because I've heard about yeah, that. Because normally new game plus takes enemies a bit tougher, like 50% more health, damage, whatever. But in 2, like, there's so many new enemy placements, it just... That sounds pretty cool, actually. Uh, is so, Dark Souls isn't out on the, 
on Switch yet, is it? Uh, not on Switch, they had complication. Which sucks. Because that's what I wanted to get it on, so I haven't got the remaster yet. And yeah, I will I get it at some point. I, I don't want to get the remaster because it's literally like a few more like frames, a bit more resolution. But on Switch it's actually portable, so it's like, oh, I can be on bus and I can be like this way and some guy. <laughs> Sweet. See, I never finished Dark Souls. I borrowed it off a friend and just to see how far I could get. And I got up to, um, I rung both the bells and then after I had to beat all the bosses. Uh, so, I, did, I did, did a little bit. Is that is that even like that far in the game then, or is it not? Because no, it, no. it felt like 40 that's hours or something. Uh, that's, that's literally <laughs> like straight up the first thing you do. It's both yeah. hours and you I, do. I remember it being the first thing you do, but I like every I remember it taking a while. Yeah, because when you first start the game, you're not gonna know all the mechanics. Of, like, if you know the mechanics, but obviously you've got new people on the mind, so it's gonna be very really hard. But iframes is the most important thing. You gotta talk. Dodging things at the perfect time. Yeah, I, I, d I didn't find like the combat very hard or anything. It's just I didn't know where to go, and I especially hated. Um, uh, I'm going to say a random name, Blighttown. and I don't... Yeah, I was about to say Blighttown, yeah. <laughs> yeah I think it was the one. the one. Everyone. It was inside a cave, and like they had like a queen ant that you fight or something. Uh, yeah, I think it is. So I, yeah, didn't li I didn't like that at all. The frame rate was awful. Yeah, the frame rate is just terrible. Like, the enemies got no way to... You're getting like, poisoned just... or something? Oh, to yeah, even worse, toxic. Toxic will kill you if yeah, you don't heal like five times. It's just, that place is just horrible. But on the good side, you can always skip it. There's like one key you can get and just skip the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Mm. No, I, I never really uh, to remember. got it. I mean, I could, um, wasn't there a class where you could like, um, easily open those doors or something? Uh, yeah, you, when you like customize class, you get the master key. You can more or less do that. But I think the thief starts on that, so you can have another special item as well. So, so maybe I should like start with that when I play to play again. I can't remember what I chose. I remember like my starting item was like Molotov, so I used it on the first boss, so I beat it without getting my weapon. Like Hello. Good. Hello. Show I am Russian. Hello Russian friend. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, that's Hello. Stepan Ivanov, or Stefan, I don't know. Stefan Ivanov. Hey Jordan, you alright? Hello Jordan, how's it going? Thank you, I'm glad you enjoyed the live stream. <laughs> now we're on my least favourite boss. Uh, Taylor, have you seen, um, have you seen like the uh, changes in Mania mode? Because... Uh, probably not. Okay, you might want to watch no, the stream. Okay, it's a what's something. It will um, it'll come oh, up shortly. Boss, so yeah, I'm on a uh, Metal Sonic now. Um, I'm at the first change, which um, is very minor, but it's easier to beat this part of the boss with the little mini Metal Sonics. Um, yeah, mini Metal Sonic. Oh. So now, um, if you hit them, like you know, you're supposed to like roll into them, like when they do the ball and bounce them back. If you, um, oh, I can't shut it off. Well, okay, maybe I can shut it off? I don't know. I'll do it here. So if you hit them while they're standing, then, um... Oh, you can just hit them. Like, their projectiles, the, the fire projectiles, um, is, uh, hits Metal Sonic. The fire projectiles do less damage than when they're rolled into a ball, but, you know. But I um, guess you can just instantly just Makes it easier. Them. Yeah. And then you're going to see the major change right now, and I might die to it because I actually don't like this boss at all. But I think the concept is really cool. Like the uh, mm, the change is really cool. He's got a chaos on I think I actually might be able to. He's, a... He's very big. Yeah, it's a reference to. Yes, I did it. I think that was a bit easier because Mighty um, can dodge his hands because um, I made a spike. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, so you can roll. I, I usually get hit by those and then fall into the bottomless pit that's behind him and that's why I don't like this boss. Oh, there is, yeah, there is a bottomless pit. 
Uh, it's, um, mm, his, really his form is like a mixture between um, the final boss from Knuckles Chaotix, which was like a red version of this, and also mm. the final boss in Sonic Heroes, which was like um, called the Metal Overlord, and he transforms into like this massive dragon Metal Sonic. Oh, cool. I thought I seen it. It's quite cool. I, I prefer. I prefer. Um, he has another form in Sonic Heroes called Neo Metal Sonic. I prefer the way that one looks, to be honest. I, re I wish they would have that as a fight. Maybe um, if you want to, Google Neo Metal Sonic. It's, it looks really cool. They should maybe like add him in like a 3D game as like a boss. Which stage are you on? Uh, I'm still in the same Which one was that? The Flying Badger. Yeah. Okay. I'm well, about 8 minutes into it. With life within 300 of rain. I love my rings. Did you pause, like, while um, you were watching me, or...? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. I just watched you for a little bit. Have you got the timer on? Are you playing Encore mode, yeah. or...? Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm still on Encore mode. I, I it's don't like think... Yeah. I know on Mania mode you can turn the um, time limit off. I think I'd prefer that, because I don't really need it at yeah, the time, just about to. Right. I'm not really a speedrunner or anything, I'm just playing and flexing. Yeah, I I keep it on, but like I'm so like, it, mostly because you have to go out of your way to press it, and like mm. I'm, I'm so used to these stages that if I get a time over on these stages, then like you may as well laugh at me for the rest of your life, oh, because... Oh, like, yeah, uh, time, time like, limits actually. Yeah. Oh god, so like, it's 10 minutes here. So yeah, but you'll time. go to the last checkpoint and you'll have... Um, actually, I don't know what will happen in Encore mode. Let me know what happens. <laughs> I don't I know think, what happens. I think it might just kill me, maybe. I'm gonna say it should be quite nice. I'm gonna guess it takes you to the last checkpoint and then gives you a different character. Like, that you already have, presuming you have another one. Yeah, yeah I've got three. Okay. So oh, it seems to be nothing though. I think you also keep your rings as well when you die. Oh, sorry. Oh, no, oh, my knuckles. Stop making me go fast. I got the Oh, it's either knuckles or uh, my. Oh. <laughs> Deep my knuckles. The only thing I have to like look into um, uh, for like the the COCOM streams, because like, obviously this is our first time doing it. Is um, mm. I I uh, don't know. Like, I I can't hear the game. Like I yeah. I've put it so I can I only hear you. Turn as well, because um, I'd, I'd rather hear you than. Yeah, I mean I could probably have like a second headphone and maybe play it through like my left ear or something. Mm. Uh, yeah, that'd be know. something to do. Probably more try. Yeah, that's probably the best thing to do. I'd say. Uh, as long as the viewers like can hear the music, that's the main thing to me right now. Yeah. Wow, twelve viewers is the highest so far. <laughs> nice, mighty. Hello, Sonic and yeah. Sonic and Tails Gaming Free and Knuckles. Oh, I man. like that name and Knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You always got Knuckles as well. Yeah, twelve people. That's quite cool. How many of you were at before? If you remember. Uh, sorry. What did you say? How many viewers have you had before that map? Um, uh, I think it was seven or eight was the highest I got, but that's Ooh. that's only the number it says down there. Because when I finish the stream, it says that like a hundred people would like watched it, like before. Oh. So I've, I, I think it counts people that don't have a council or something. I don't know. Possibly. Hello, Trinity Cova. Um, yeah, so um, with the game's music, because um, Mark's review asked the question, um, so I. I usually try, I mean, I transform into super whenever I feel like it really. A lot of the time I transform whenever I lose my shield. Um, but it also depends on what the boss is. So like for example, the boss in the stage, um, I don't need supersonic at all. Because I, um, I find this boss pretty... Well you don't even, you, you can't even, supersonic doesn't even make a difference with this boss. But sometimes like, I might turn into super because I want to use super for the boss. Um, but yeah, the music point is a good point. Like, I like having the music. Um, I can't hear it, but I mean, you guys can hear it, so... It's nice to hear it. Yeah. 
because Sonic music's always been like one of the best. Of it always have a lot of good stuff. Yeah, Sonic Sonic music's amazing. Mm -hmm. Like I literally listen to it sometimes. It's like on, on one of my list. It's just something really like even Shadow the Hedgehog has some good music. Even yeah. if it ends a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Are you including like just vocal tracks or like level tracks? Uh, vocal, I'd say more. Like yeah. Little I am I quite like that one. I just think it's like the main one for it. Yeah. Um, yeah, I quite like the um, the vocal in that game. I can't really remember the stage tracks very well, but I wouldn't say yeah, they're bad. Know. I just I just haven't played the game enough, probably. Yeah. Or there might be a long time since played it as well. Yeah, I I, I've, I actually don't ever think I've ever finished that game properly. Actually, I used action replay to complete that game. <laughs> so I think I'll play it like. 12 times, or play 12 times to get the actual ending. Yeah. It's just well, the worst thing for a I game with multiple endings. <laughs> I, I still did it 12 times, but I had like infinite rings and stuff. Oh, I see. I usually go super right that's before the boss so I can hear the level music, then the boss music plays afterwards. Yeah, that's, that's so something I like yeah. to do sometimes as well. That's a good idea. Do you like my picture? Um, I, can't oh, really, I can't really see it because the chat's really small. <laughs> yeah, um, my TV's quite far away, so all my money. Oh, I, can't, I can't click on your name. <laughs> is it? Is it um, Sonic Mania? I, th I think it might be Sonic Mania, but I'm not really sure because it's really small. I'm What's sorry. Sonic Mania? Um, his uh, profile picture, Trinity Cove. Oh, I can't. I can't really see it. It looks red. Yeah, red with like a bit of um, blue in the back. It might be yeah. Mighty and Ray then if you say yellow. Oh, maybe yeah. But I mean, he might be able to confirm that. Yeah. But... <laughs> yeah, we're both lines, so what the hell? Oh, what? I think I was gonna, gonna ask, what's your favourite um, Sonic soundtrack? Tails.exe. Uh, oh, that would explain the red, though. <laughs> ah, that would be it then. Thank so you for letting saying. us know. So, uh, oh, I'm... is there actually a Tails of EXE as well? I know if it's a... Yeah, he's um. I know if it's probably a Tails of EXE. Yeah, oh, I got crushed. <laughs> um, uh, one th uh, thing I need to quickly actually say uh, I haven't said this all stream, and I usually remind people, like, in certain times of the stream, there's a poll in the description, and if you go to the poll, you can vote for what playthrough you want me to do next. Um, I've already done Sonic and Tails, I've already done uh, Ray, and I've already done Mighty. The ones left are playing as Tails by himself with debug mode activated, playing as um, Knuckles with and Knuckles mode activated, playing Encore mode or playing Cheats mode. So if you go to the description, then is the poll not there? Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Give a minute to that, I think. Yeah, it's the same poll as well that I was doing. I don't think the... Uh, oh, I, think, I think I closed it actually. Oh, did you? Okay. I, I got a better way then. Um, everyone in the chat, write either Tails, Knuckles, Encore Mode, or Cheat. And whichever one I see the most now will be the winner. Encore Mode Cheat. Yeah, that's fair enough. Because otherwise I've got to stop like the whole stream and like um, add to the poll and everything. And we, yeah. I, I think you guys want to of... keep seeing the gameplay, you know. Yeah, quite a bit of effort right now, yeah. Tails, tails. We've got two tails so far. Good choice, Ooh. guys. Tails. Who <laughs> likes tails? I was playing with them now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, because like encore, yeah. yeah. I've been looking forward to Tails, to be honest, because it's debug mode, and I love playing debug mode. Well, the, the mode that I was doing was doing is going to be debug mode anyway. Yeah. It's Tails is right now. But debug mode, isn't it? No, I, I, quite, I really like Tails. I just like... Because yeah. this is the third playthrough I've done for a stream. I like to like change things up, you know? Yeah, you don't have to always be the same. Because okay. I just, just, you know, does the same thing all the time. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I would, like, I wouldn't mind playing this game, like, a million times. <laughs> yeah, it's, it is already good. This is so fun to play. Um, so I've just got all the classic Sonic games, put them all together, and just make them better. That's straight up what it is. 
to all of them. Ooh. Uh, Spring, Stephen, or Stefan, Trap, 1, 2, 3. I make a mod on Sonic Mania. A lot for it. Yeah, that's interesting. I imagine that's... some PC in it. Yeah, I was thinking about getting the PC version, and when I get it, I would actually stream it and stream mods. So mm. I don't know when that will be. That'll probably be quite a bit away because I'd need to like buy the PC version, and I don't have the money for it at the moment. But um, mm. yeah, um, I'd show off like as many mods as I can, including like yours and stuff. Like once yours is done, so. That'd be um, pretty cool, actually. Yeah. If you want, you can let us know what um, the mod's going to be like, and yeah, um, I'll look into it. <laughs> that actually says that. What, what, what did Matt put? Give me vodka. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> it sounds like a true Russian man. Speaking of Sonic.exe, there's a Sonic.exe mod for um, Sonic Mania. Is there? Yeah. Oh god, is it terrifying? <laughs> I'm uh, not as terrifying as um, the like original Sonic.exe. I'm so glad that Mighty can like not get hurt by spikes. Oh great, and I got crushed there. <laughs> oh, so dead. dead. <laughs> He's almost uh, invincible. Jordan Carver, the console that I'm playing it on is the Nintendo Switch. Hey, same here. <laughs> That's what both players on, isn't it? Yeah. I think this is probably best on the Switch because there's like no downsides to it and it's portable. So it's just. You know. Yeah. I have it on the PS4 as well, but um, like, I, just, I bought it again. <laughs> That's fair enough. I technically if, have if this you game. Like game Amazon buy it, sport I, I don't know. One of my mates has Resident Evil 4 on every console, like, eight or nine times, like, every console. Because oh. he loves it so much. That's a game that's worth it, because Resident yeah, Evil 4 is amazing. I'd, I'd love 4 so much. It's like, it's probably... I don't really know. I like the old Resident Evil a lot more, but Resident Evil 4 is the best of its cut by it. Resident Evil 4 is probably my favourite out of all of them. But... Even, what about 7? What's your opinion on that? I haven't played it. I, I'd love 7. If you play it. I haven't played it. I, I, I'm planning to like, get to it at some point, but I just haven't put that to it. I haven't even played I'll 6. Probably like it, especially... uh, skip, uh, skip 6. <laughs> <laughs> as much as I love Resident Evil 6, it's, uh, it's not bad, but it's very forgettable. Yeah, and very... I... not much. How, 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 like, is it better than, um, uh, 5? <laughs> I didn't like that. Oh, I've got no rings, this isn't very good. Yes. Oh, yes, yes, there we go. <laughs> um, nice. always come back. FNAF. Hot Silka on FNAF 6. I, I don't really play Five Nights at Freddy's, but I've watched people play it, and it it does look like pretty interesting. One of my um. It does seem pretty. Wait. Is Sorry? 6 new, or was 6 minutes out? I have no idea. Oh, I don't I don't was... keep up with the series. I've, uh, I used to keep up with it until 4. Like, it's a really good series in that, but I'm very bad with horror games. <laughs> like, very bad. Man, that please gets knocked off the corner again. I have um, a group of um, friends um, who uh, cosplayed mm -hmm. the FNAF characters, and it was really, really good. <laughs> Bonnie, Chica, Freddy. Foxy, everyone's favourite. I was boy. I think one of them was Bonnie, I really recognise that. And I think one yeah. of them was Chica. I can't really remember their names. One of them was Randy yellow, one of them was purple, Fox. and the other one was white, I think. What? Oh, maybe Foxy. I think maybe. there's another one that's white, that goes with the name. Tails the Foxy. Tails the Foxy. <laughs> this sound really like a fellow for it. It's on like more. I Where's think you can actually Sonic animatron. Yeah. I think you can actually play the stage just by doing the spin dash the whole time that if I recall correctly. Really? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. I think when you get to the shield you have to at least jump over it. Ooh. Jordan Carver says I like Encore mode. Encore mode is really fun. I'm uh Um I will be getting so to that at some now, point. Right? It looks like by the looks of things I'll be playing as Tails next probably like. Yeah, that's alright. Okay, yeah, this is the show. Oh, this is cool, lad. 
Oh, oh no, no, I got hit. It doesn't matter because it doesn't have a shield later on on stage. So is this, is this gonna. No, it's not gonna push me over. Tails.exe, you should make a video of you playing Sonic.exe. Please <laughs> try it out. Have you played like, any DLCs? Yeah. Um, I've watched uh, some Cool and Johnny, well, the Super Gaming Brothers play them. I haven't played them myself. Um, oh, I've played. Uh, there was a Sonic 1 ROM hack with Sonic.exe. Mm -hmm. Basically, um, and it was pretty creepy actually. Um, basically, you have. You play through like Green Hill Zone normally, and like the other stages normally, and then after like a while, um, EXE Sonic will start chasing you, and it will play the drowning music, and you have to oh, try and like run away from him. Mm. That was quite scary. Back in the day, it's not good to die. No, no, it's special enough for the factory. But yeah, notice um, I went through like that whole stage just by holding the spin dash. <laughs> oh. You, it's only really possible with Mighty, like oh, you probably yeah. could do that as the other characters, but the thing is Mighty can, um, he's invincible to spikes and projectiles, so you don't have to worry about getting hit. And then I at least jump over the shield because, um, uh, because like it blocks you and pushes you to the side while you're flying, so oh, that was the shield. Oh. One ring away oh, from 99, but I'm on the boss. What's in the I don't like the boss. She's not the best level. I saw the pool works and you get to jump in a gun and just shoot yourself, but in a different way. I am um, Sign was actually going to ask a second ago, and chat can answer this question if they want as well. What's your um, favourite song, like, well, favourite music track in like a Sonic game? Uh, so like, it, um, I mean like the whole soundtrack, so... Oh, the whole soundtrack, not just one song. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm not only too sure. I know Sonic Mania is obviously like got a really good sound. Yeah, yeah. Especially like the Encore ones, because it's like the same but bad. Is it different? I can't even really remember it. Sorry. I I mean but I haven't really played I'm busy playing like uh, mostly Hollow Knight and it's usually that one but like I got a bad ending, I think. Is that it's a really bad ending. Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle that you have or Yeah, I think it would be. Do you have it on Switch? I know I've got it on I've got it on the PS. Sad face. I've played a bit of the story on Switch. It seems alright. The story is okay, it's mostly the crossover that's like fun. Yeah. It just seems pretty cool though. I've got a lot of fun, like fan fighters, but I think my favourite one straight up is Soul Calibur. Just of all dying. Soul Calibur's a cool. fighter. Yeah, I like Soul Calibur. Just, you can customise your peeps, you've got, like, everyone's unique, I guess it's the same one fighting, so. It's one of the most used to. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty much like okay with like any fighter, but I prefer like the Blaze Blue style ones. Um, mm. I, I, I'm not a fan of like Mortal Kombat. I don't like the way the game controls. I, I don't like how blocking is walking backwards. It makes sense in a way to like keep the game like fluid and fast and stuff, but I can't like a block button or something like that or dodge. I don't mind that because Blaze Blue does that. Um, I just I don't mind. I just don't like. Um, uh, I don't like the fact that the way it's, it's just the way it controls. I just don't like. Yeah. The characters I'm not just a fan feel a bit different. Much. It's not bad in it's, it's good and all, it's just not my time. I know, it's terrible. Well, it's, for fighting games, it's Smash Bros. It's fucking terrible. Smash Bros. is just amazing. You can't fault Smash Bros. Oh, I can fault Smash Bros. I'm oh, kidding. No, but skin. But skin 2018. Uh, um. Uh. What are your thoughts on the new one coming out? What, the new, uh. Old Smash Bros. Yeah. It seems a lot. I'm probably going to maybe when it goes down to ice, because I own it on 3DS and uh, Wii U. I know it's different and all, but I don't think it's that different to be quite again just yet. That's a funny one, down in press. You do you do know what company made the game? <laughs> I think that's the problem. I'm probably waiting for a few fans to get it. But I, I probably won't be getting it new. Well, I would get the new dodge, but... I'm I'm I am i am not really too keen on getting it. I'll play it when I'm around my friends. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm sure. It, all, but I've, yeah. Nice. I'm sure the game will be really good. Oh, it's gonna be amazing. It's just in Smash Bros. 
Uh, Matt asks who your mains are. I'm oh, mainly not as fat. Such My mains? I have like. The problem with these games like that is I have like so many mains. So, like, if I have Overwatch, I have like 20 mains, I guess. I'm, I'm very like. Fun and everything. So, yeah. But for um, Smash, I'd probably say. I like Ike a lot. Ike's like really cool. Especially in Punch People. Even though he's got a sword. <laughs> uh, I like King Diddy, but he's just kind of like hard to use because all the people are quite good at walking slightly to the left. Uh, oh, freaking Samus. Zero Suit Samus. She's like so fast. Like, I like her down B where she like jumps and kicks someone's face and jumps like, more from it. Uh, Villager I like a lot. He's really cool. I like his tree, even though it's hard to use because people walk away from it and like, no, my foliage. Come to my foliage. I love that that villager was in that game. <laughs> He's just so fun. I just like all the fun characters, really. But I can't really think of any proper names. I, so I, I guess I'll go through the characters that I mostly pick. Yeah. Um, uh, my favourites are, well, you probably guessed by the game I'm playing. <laughs> I love Mario. <laughs> uh, so my favourites are Sonic, uh, Captain Falcon, uh, oh, Link. Um, oh, let me go up. Pac Man. And I also, um, I'm not very good with him, but I like playing as uh, Ness and Lucas. Oh, I, I love uh, similar with him, but I like how saying that she carries everyone, but you have to like, get the timing for to use her, right? Yeah. It's not really fun to use, but it's so hard to use. You've got to predict your opponent like perfect. I never um, got really too into her, but you did remind me I like playing as Ike, uh, not Ike, Pit. I love playing as Pit. Yeah, yeah I quite like Pit. He's, he's pretty, yeah. We really, really need another Kid Icarus game. I loved Kid Icarus Uprising so much. I just probably played it, yeah. I've played a massive pack of the games, that's what I've played. And that's one of them. Don't worry, I do too. And one of mine is Mario Odyssey. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it's best game, you should play it all the time. I do like the game a lot. It's really good. I assume you played um, Breath of the Wild. I like Breath of the Wild a lot as well. That was really good. That game was amazing. There was just so much to do in it. Like, the problem is with a lot of open world games nowadays is they have massive. And games like Zelda and Odyssey have just been like. You don't have to make it massive, just make it like, full of stuff. Just like, give a world that's kind of big, not too big, but just fill it with everything so every corner has something new. And I wish a lot of games did. But yeah. We're just getting so many empty worlds. Where it's like, I don't want to explore this because it's just empty. It's kind of like Far Cry in there. Far Cry has that problem where it looks full, but you're literally just picking up like a bit of tissue off the floor a hundred times. A <laughs> tissue? It's, just, it's a bit of, yeah. It's just busy work. But I want fun stuff to do with my life. Really. So, well, I mean, it kind of depends because I feel like, like the core oxy to are basically that. Um, mm. But I mean, they're optional, so it's okay. Um, I, I know I said I wasn't going to say anything else about Mario Odyssey, but <laughs> I feel like that all you do in that game mm. is just pick up moons, and they all get like handed to you, and they're everywhere. Like they, they probably like from what I've seen, and because I haven't finished the game, mm. from what I've seen, I feel like they could have taken out like 300 of them, and nobody would have like said anything. You know? Yeah, I kind of see what you mean. There's a lot of them, but you kind of I feel a sense of achievement every time you get one, and because they're giving you quite a lot, it's fine. Yeah. They're not yeah. as good as stars in Mario 64 because you feel like you earn those more. But I still like hitting loads of them. Which Matt is, says uh, he mains Bayonetta, Cloud, and Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong, I love Diddy Kong. He's so <laughs> fun to do. I love jumping at people's faces and just going. In. It's so good. And Bowser as well. I love Bowser for Super Smash. Just pick some off, jump for your edge, and that's it. <laughs> it over. But, like, I've never really got a hang of Bayonetta because I think she's all about combos. And I'm in like Smash Bros. I'm very bad at combos. I like Smash attacks more than anything. And that's really good with um, Bayonetta. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think the only like fast count that can play really well is probably just Zero Suit Sack. Just because of her, she has like some combos in there. Not as good as Bayonetta. Not even like Captain Falcon? Uh, I like Captain Falcon a lot, he's like all about punches and 
and uh, again and go for this thing. Yeah. Because he's, uh, he's basically the attacking Falcon. Oh, but yeah. purple. <laughs> purple Falcon. What other um, like Switch yeah. games do you have? Hmm? Switch games? Uh, let me check. I've got a bottle of them, more or less. But the ones I've played most is like Isaac, I come back to quite a lot, I'm Isaac, which you might have played. Uh, no, I haven't played, but I've heard of it. It's like Zelda, but RNG, right? Uh, kind of, but more skill based, I'd say. It's like super fun. And the Gungeon, better, I'd say, because they're both like really good and separate from each other. But it's basically okay. dungeon exploring where you got to kill lots of enemies, a little red room, and stuff like that. Uh, Hollow Knight, obviously, I've been playing a lot of. Uh, there's a game called Sh Sheepy, Sheppy, if you heard of that, you probably haven't. No, I haven't, no. Uh, you, you basically have one sheep and then you've got to make a thousand of them. I took me a Switch game. That sounds very it's weird. Card, it's, it's a card game as well, so like, you, you can double them, and then you've got a card which just kills all your sheep. It's like, why would you play that? And okay. It's, it's random. Fun. <laughs> I'm actually kind of interested to at least look up a video of this now. Yeah, it's, it's only like four quid, it's just a little bit like a lot. But it's, okay. it's really weird. I love it. I've got Glasgow as well, I haven't played it. But it's Lime Sand. It's actually the neat way, but. Wait, so you have Blaze Blue on Switch then? I do, yeah. Oh, okay. I, I thought you said you had it on PS4. Uh, I've got a different one on PS4. I, Wait, don't know, I think I've got like a different Glasgow. Okay, so the one on Switch is the cross tag one with Ruby that and Persona, yeah. right? Yeah, okay, that's yeah, that's the one I meant. So we can play that online and Matt can play that with us as well. Yeah, try it out and stuff. I was thinking of doing a stream with that one time. There's one guy that I like, so I play. But he seems a bit OP, he's got like a big scythe and massive range. Oh, Gordo. Yeah, Matt Might plays be. as him a lot. He's from uh, uh, Unib. Like, he's got so much range. Yeah. Our favourites are um, Noelle. Um, do you know who she is? Uh, I think she's a little girl, isn't she? From Last Blue. Yeah, I yeah. Think. Has um, two I think guns. I think um, I've seen her. her and Yang from Ruby. I really like. Yeah. And, I haven't uh, played Yang yet, but I've got it. I like um, Yukiko as well from Persona and Yosuke. Mm. Oh, yeah. You can get all of them, can't you? But I think DLC for some of the main. Yeah, uh, I guess and now to the DLC. Oh, yeah. Sweet. A lot of people want them um, to put Adachi as DLC. <laughs> I'd, I'd love that, please. If me my Adachi. I'd love to have him as DLC in this dancing. I'd, I'd never expected, like, yeah. It was really cool. Especially how like, evil he is to you. <laughs> Stop making fun of you all the time, like, Stop. Wait, um. He's DLC? I, d I don't remember him being DLC in the dancing game. Yeah, they, they had a Maria and it that as DLC in uh, Persona 4 dancing. With uh, the boss song and... I can't remember Maria's song. Oh, okay. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't remember that. I don't know. Oh, they were like 350 each or 250? Kind of cheap. But really cool. Oh. I, I really like playing... Because obviously they're really hard as well, like boss. Oh, the Miku one was a bit surprising. I didn't. I wasn't expecting Miku. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't thinking about either. I remember looking at the DLC thinking, Miku, what? Okay. I'm happy with it. I'm a bit um, disappointed with uh, the Persona 3 and 5 dancing, to be honest. Oh, no, really? Yeah. Like, it, it's not bad, but I liked 4 a lot better. Mm. Oh damn. The, mu the, the music in um, Persona 5 dancing, like I didn't like any of the tracks more than the well, the original ones. Oh, I thought all of the original ones were better. Whereas in Persona 4, I actually liked most of the new ones more than the original. Yeah, I did um, say that. The ones I, they made for uh, the 4 dancing was so much better than the original. Because like I might, it might be because Persona 5 just like the soundtrack is already like godly anyway. <laughs> yeah, make it better. Just amazing. Hello, my classic Sonic. My my favourite Sonic. Hello, how's it going? How you doing? Persona 3 had quite a few really good songs, though the dancing one. 
Oh, that's still weird. That's only a pledge for you. I've only like, started it, and the beginning's very... very weird compared to the other two. It kind of starts out like, bam, here's... and then throws you into it. It's a bit of a different tone compared to... uh... three and... sorry, yeah. compared to four, 4 and 5. 4 and 5 I'm like, very happy in that, but 3 is kind of like... Coughing yeah. Coughing is evil stuff, Ooh. It's, it's kind of cool, right? It's probably, um... Really uh, have you played like any of the Shima actual proper Shimogami Tensei games? Oh. Uh, no, I don't think I have actually. Okay, when I you finish so. with when you finish with like three, then maybe mm. like look into some of the Shimogami Tensei yeah. games. There's a strange, um, strange journey came out this year. I really want to play that. It's like a, a 3DS remake of a DS game. Oh, I think I was, I was either ordering that or I've ordered it like literally today. That they, it look, it's, it's apparently really good, so I want to get that. Mm. Um, it is not quite a neat one. If not that, then um, there's uh, some other Sumo Kami Tensei games on the 3DS. Yeah, I think I've got and... a pocket of it, I haven't tried it. And I've got Persona 4 level? Yeah, Persona 4 slash Sumo Kami Oh, Persona Q. Yeah. Oh, I mean, that's technically not Sumo Kami Tensei, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and uh, Nocturne on the PS2. What's uh, it? Shimogami Tensei Nocturne. I think it's called Lucifer's Call know. over here, actually. Every day is great at your gym. <laughs> Every day is great at your job. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realise that Matt put that. <laughs> <laughs> What's down this? Oh, I can't go down that way. Got so many lives. I wish I had one. Oh, was that 21 or 30? 32. Oh, I'll oh, tune Are you, um... Oh, you're gonna get 200 right? It's not as good as um, when I used to play Sonic 3 and Knuckles. When I played Sonic 3 and Knuckles, uh, mostly on the DS because it was portable, I had ended the game with yeah, 99 it's... lives. Yeah. It's probably the But, um, partly because there's one point in, um, Launch Zone, I think it is. Um, where you have these sirens, and when you go past the sirens, bad nicks come towards you and start attacking you. So I sat at the little siren and did a little um, spin dash, and stayed there, so I just held down for ages. And um, they just kept attacking me, um, but they would get, they would die because I was in bull mode. And I just yeah. sat there until I got 99 lives. Oh! Because <laughs> you, you get life. Like the Mario attack thing was just hit. Yeah, yeah, basically. <laughs> Because you get um, lives um, when you get a certain amount of score as well. Oh, was the score? I didn't know about score. Yeah, I think it's like 5,000 and then after that it's 10,000 and then you get it every 10,000. Or maybe 100,000, I can't remember. I think it's... Yeah. I think it oh, is. I didn't know about the score thing though. It's pretty neat on. I've only known about the 100 rings thing. So I think that's what most like, platformers have more or less. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. It's a reward for collecting all the little bits and bobs. Heading down to the second half of Lava Reef Zone. I, re I really like quite like the aesthetic of the second act of Lava Reef. Um, obviously it's similar to what they did with um, the Sonic 3 and Knuckles, but still. I just realised something. The treadmills in the stage are um, the treadmills in Sonic CD. I can't remember the stage. I think, I think it was... They look different, yeah. I think it was... Um, well, I think it was in Collision oh. Chaos, I can't remember. Yeah, I think they were in Collision oh, Chaos. Yeah. Secret ring here, I think, is it here? Possibly. Somewhere up there. I I found it for the first time just two streams ago. I can't love to get it. For the first time? <laughs> yeah, I didn't know that one was That's there. That's one thing I love about some games, we can just find new things later on. Yeah. And I've... you feel like, wow, I, I can't believe I've never knew this before. I found. There's a game I did that recently. Was like, was new. Oh, Fire Emblem. I Fire Emblem Waking. I played it like to completion like five times. But there's so much stuff I didn't know on it. Like all this new, like growth rates. Whenever you level up, there's a random percentage like the stats you get. But I never knew that. And it's just it's all this new stuff I realised. Ah, oh, uh, I didn't know that. I knew like um, your 
do stats are like RNG based when you level up or something. Yeah, no matters on your character and your class, and your kids can inherit the last part both the characters got the mum and dad. It's just something else I didn't know. And now I've got Gale Force and like 20 people, and so yeah. Now when I kill someone, I get an extra turn. That's like all my characters get an extra turn more or less, which is super handy. I need to like get into like fire at some point. Yeah, I don't like, know man. I, I like absolutely love it. it looks I know. <laughs> I think at the spring. There we go. Even you, even job. I didn't want that special stage. Let's just get a red sphere. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just going to kill yourself in the middle, aren't you? Yeah, I, I might do like a stream where I get all of them because I found out you can delete your data and like, you know, I could delete my data and then start from the beginning and get all of the blue sphere stages, you know, on the stream. Which is the, when you said that, I was like, wow, that's actually a really cool thing. Like, I wish some other games did that as well, with delete certain bits that you don't want. Yeah. Because normally it's like all or nothing, isn't it? Pretty much. I wish like um, Persona had uh, more stuff that you could um, turn on and off, like when you do New Game Plus. Like you can yeah, choose like more than what you want. So I remember um, we'll Persona at certain points as well. That'd be cool. I remember Persona mm. Three. You kept your level when you um, did New Game Plus. Oh really? Yeah. And then Persona Three um, Festival or FES took that out and the portable version. I think the portable version brings it back. No, I think you can choose in the portable version actually. Uh, I can't remember. And then Persona 4 didn't have it until... Yeah, and Persona 5 didn't have it. Persona 5 is amazing it is. Probably my, one of my best and favourite games of that year. That's it. It was my favourite game that year. Yeah, just fantastic. It's the very first Persona game I've ever actually played as well. So oh, playing yeah, Masterpiece yeah. is like, wow. Ooh, this is amazing. I'm one ring away from being super, and I'm at the boss. I'm gonna have to play this boss legitimately, and I don't like this boss. What, you can beat him legitimately? Wait a minute. I'm not gonna mind this boss as much, because Mighty is invincible to the spikes. Oh, what is this boss? I love the The, um... Oh, cool. The uh, motor bug. Can you roll into it? Sorry? You, oh, you, so you, a, you attack the um, hard ball heavy on top. Uh, uh, is that little uh, spike ball thing that he throws around on top of him or swings around? It's really, really hard to avoid. But, yeah, like, it's really annoying. But Mighty like can just ignore it. That's how I do this. That's why I get to him plays Mighty. If I get to him, I'm, I'm taking my sweet time. It might be really hard. I love playing with mine. Oh crap, Tails can fly! I, I know that sounds dumb, but I thought I could just hover. <laughs> Wait, really? You didn't know? Yeah. I, I just thought you like, hover and just fly a bit more like, length, but no, oh. you can just you can fly. But then you just fly across the level. Oh, that's like, that was really cool. You can also, um... You have Tails as your partner, and you hold up and keep tapping the jump button. You can kind of like control Tails flying, and then if you jump onto him, you can have Tails carry you. Really? Yeah. Tails, are you? Just two more stages left. I'm on the tap now. So. Mm, I should say two more zones actually. Because um, obviously there's two um, acts, but it's like... Yeah. Oh, sorry, I quite like that bit. I think the first thing is like the original way in Or oh, oh, not really, but a different variation. Yeah, so the first oh, one is like the original, like with um, like with the first couple of acts from the original mixed together. And then the second one like changes stuff up. Except Hydro City, where that's what? kind of like the opposite way around, for some reason. Yeah. That first one quite idea what I did. I just think this whole game is pretty damn cool. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to um, getting a, a new version of this game. Which I assume probably come out like maybe next year maybe, or the year after. Yeah, it's going to be some time at least. 
because it didn't it didn't actually take them like too long to make this game. I think it was like over a year to make this game. That's fair enough. So you said you have to make too many and that's it. And then was using the same what they have. Yeah. Adding a bit more to more levels and stuff. Well the um the engine and engine and stuff was actually um something that uh, Christian White had made himself, I think. Oh really? Yeah, because he used to make Sonic fan games and um, he did a couple of other projects as well and pitched them to Sega and then the ports of like Sonic 1 used this engine it's like to try and replicate like what the Genesis games were like but obviously this it is does it briefly. this is better than the Genesis games as well I don't know why I just said Genesis mm. games oh my god I just said Genesis games <laughs> it's called the Mega Drive oh my oh yeah different, different country and stuff where it would be yeah. I keep getting crushed by random stuff. Not like in the same zone, but throughout the whole game. I just keep getting crushed by stuff. I don't know what's going on. I think it's being unlucky today. <laughs> going too fast. Yeah, too fast for the world. <laughs> the world wants to kill me. <laughs> but I'm not playing Scott Pilgrim. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah, that was a different game. Yeah, it was. You can't oh, buy it anymore. Oh, yeah. No. They, um, Ubisoft lost the license and they didn't get it back. Oh, so it's just it's gone now. I think I have it downloaded on something. Probably uh, 360. Yeah, I still have it on the 360. Mm -hmm. That's another game for me to play later on again. Never gonna <laughs> delete it, because that's like one of my favourite games ever. And Really? Yeah, and the movie is my favourite film of all time. Either that or um, uh, this is going to be a bit of a dramatic change because this is, movie is like nothing like Scott Pilgrim. But if not Scott Pilgrim, <laughs> then my favourite movie would either be the, um, the Little Mermaid or Tangled. Little Mermaid, okay. Tangled, okay. Yeah, I really like those films. Not, not, not bad ones. Let's turn super. I don't really need it, but this makes it a bit easier. Yeah. These bosses are one hit kill anyway, fight. so. Spider oh, I wasn't looking. I looked. My phone flashed when I looked at my phone, and then after, the next thing oh, I noticed, I got juice. crushed. Oh, we yeah, even that bit. Yeah. Oh, we can actually just stand and just. Oh uh, yeah, oh, yeah, you crushed. I I am. Um, I was invincible. That's why the electric didn't hurt me. Uh, oh, I see. It's hard to tell, but um, Super Mighty has um. Uh, his, his, his form of super form is like only a tiny little bit different to his actual form, the way he looks. Ooh. Like Sonic Returns Gold, it's just a tiny bit shinier and it's hard to tell. Yeah, I was going to say, didn't we look too shiny? Just looks, looks right. Just like spewing random ideas out there. Like if you um want to ever come onto a stream again, we could do Splatoon. Mm. Oh hell yeah, that's what I heard of <laughs> well, I, I did lost balloons. Yeah. I've even got uh, like, the Octopath expansion. I haven't played it yet. The Octopath expansion? Yeah, the Octopath expansion. The <laughs> Octopath the Travel. Character. Yeah, um, I have it's the expansion, yeah. I was thinking yeah. about live streaming the expansion, because I haven't played it yet. Hmm. I can't think it'd be hard, which I quite like. The original game is uh, pretty easy, but obviously it's quite casual. I heard from um, Matt um, that it's hard, but. I don't know. Yeah, it's like, oh, oh is, Matt the, is Matt the guy that plays Splatoon's a lot? Like, like, oh. Yeah, he's the one we played Splatoon with. Mm -hmm. um, you, also, you also met him when he came to mine. Yeah, I remember seeing him though. Yeah. Like, oh, and then the Will that he was in the chat, I don't know if he's still there. He might still be. Um, that's uh, the... He's Splatoon. Like, yeah, that, that's the one you play um, uh, VR with, Rekrum. I've played it as well. I've played it with uh, uh, I think that, I think. Maybe, like when he came around or something, I don't know. Yeah. Because I know Matt doesn't have a PS4. It's cool stuff, though. Have you, yeah, have you actually played it yet? Or, like, Red 
No, I haven't. I just watch a bunch of players. Yeah. It's strong, though. It feels amazing to play. Maybe. Like, if you can paint more physics, if you can laser tag, it just it feels so good. It doesn't look bad, I don't think. It's just like, I never really like to play VR games. Because I just, I, I haven't really tried them, but it just, it's, it seems like it makes you feel a bit sick. Yeah, it's not for everyone. I do get travel sick quite a bit. I get travel sick like, pretty easily. Be... You turn into um, a chippy you... version of yourself when you hit the lasers. Oh! I fucking just listened to the stream, I was like, it's, it's such baby mighty. <laughs> It's adorable. It is adorable. Uh, Ray is even better though. It's Ray like, looks so chibi, cute. Chibi Ray. It was cute enough as it is. That one that was trying to take you one. I'm going to go there. Yeah. I've been busy, you know, so I know I met Donald, Matt, and Willy. Willy. Pretty young. <laughs> as well as obviously the guys with Donald. I think I skipped over the um, crush section. Because there was a section I'd never been to before, and it like crushes, like there's loads of crushes similar to the ones from the boss that I just fought earlier from the last yeah. stage. And I never knew that area was there until the first um, Sonic Mania stream I did. And then ever since, like I kept going into that area for some reason every time I played it. Oh. So, so I, I, I managed to avoid it this time because I didn't really like that area. Makes me feel claustrophobic. Kind of. Makes sense. I'm afraid of Santa like Claus. Not nice if you don't like the place. Oh my god, the crabs are playing frisbee! Yep. <laughs> the crabs. I was quite far behind. So you're in um, uh, Press Garden. Yeah. I'm looking quite forward to when I next play Encore mode because when I first played it, I didn't get any Chaos Emeralds because the special stages were too hard. I haven't actually seen any special stages at all. Like, none. I don't know if I've, I haven't really been looking. Uh, when you fight the boss um, at the first act, right at the end of the act, you know, there's a bit where like the ground breaks. Um, don't fall down, jump to the right. There's like a box. Um, there's a box, um, and behind, like, you jump on the box, and then behind the box is a special ring. You can try it there. Oh, it looks. Let's try that one out. I barely saved myself from getting hurt. I hit an Eggman monitor, and right before I got hit, I turned into Super Mighty, so I wouldn't get hit. Oh, nice. <laughs> Pretty good reaction time for myself, if I say so myself. I think... Well, what is the box you said about breaking? You couldn't get to him before, did you? No, no. It seems really weird. But if it was in the game before, might he get in? Yeah. It was like it was like he was meant to be there all along. Yeah. It was meant to be. <laughs> There's that boss. Oh, I'm good One more zone to go. <laughs> I love that little glitch where he just slides off the thing. <laughs> The capsule. It's so funny. It's pretty cool little thing. Oh yeah. You just slides off like, yeah! I'm number one. I tried this like new drink recently. Um, you know um, Oasis? They had like mm -hmm. this, um, two new versions. And one of them is like raspberry and one of them is cherry. Um, but they're like flavoured water. And um, if you have the raspberry one, it makes you feel warm. And if you um, like, it has it has something in it that makes your like mouth feel like a bit warm. And if you have the cherry yeah. one, it makes you feel a bit cold. So I I bought like a couple of the cherry ones, and it actually like is kind of weird. It kind of works. <laughs> yeah, that sounds a bit strange. That's pretty cool. What is it like? New Oasis? The new Oasis thing? Something. Yeah, it's um, Oasis Aqua Shock. Oh, that's not quite shocking. What's that literally hotter than this? I guess that'd be right in window. I, 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 I didn't have any interest in trying that one. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just the level of freaking heaven. It's just yeah. heat. Just heat, that's it.
it's not, it's not, the taste isn't like, like the best thing ever. Like, it's okay, but it's like, because of the way it makes you feel, it's kind of nice. And I quite like flavoured water, I have a lot of Volvix, so. I guess it's quite a lot of Volvix. It's not, it's not, there's no water to be, it's not down to it, I guess. The flavour's like, ooh, it's like water yeah. flavour. I love lemon, <laughs> lemon flavour. <laughs> Lemon's quite nice. I think I like apple and pear some more. Oh yeah. Yeah, is that the Volvic or...? Yeah. Yeah, I, I tried the apple one a long ago, it was quite nice. I don't know what's going on, but I'm going fast. Yeah, go fast. That's what it's about, right? <laughs> Yeah, there is a bit where you go in the loop. Um, so, do you know the bit where you run on the tube and you go upside down and to the top and whatever? Make sure yeah. you stick to the top. Oh, yeah. And then just uh, just after that is the special stage I was talking about. So, jump over the boxes when you see them. Yes. Yeah. I want me a ray. What? Got none. You get to see the very, very first 3D mod model of Ray in the Sonic series. Oh, was it? Was it? Yep. Because it was only in one game, and it? it was in the 90s, and it was 2D. Oh, I've got nothing to get. Oh, you're trying the, um... The like... Pinball series. Oh, okay. Now I meant there's a special ring behind the boxes just after the checkpoint. Once you get to that. Oh, I want see, something how, see how you do with the ultra hard special stages. Yes! I got me a knuckle. Nice. Oh, extra life. 36. I must have like gotten about 40 of them in this run because I'm sure I died like four times. Oh, wait, yeah. I forgot about what you said and I just went through right now. Catch the UFO. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Let me know how you do because I find them really hard. I'm doing the space one, I guess. The space two? Yeah, yeah, it'll be the same one as me. Oh, they're, all, they're all the same order. Seems alright. At the moment. At the moment. Yeah. Imagine, it seems like there's a lot of time. Yeah, you have to go to um, Mark 3 to catch up. Oh, yes. Oh, no. Oh, Mac, do this. He's already got a lot of fast. The statue of the fucking No, I think the 3 is like double the speed. Those corners are almost impossible. Yeah, you have to get really used to the controls. Hello, MOT Boko. Boko. Oh, Boko no I, I can't wait to buy this game. Oh, this game is amazing. You're in oh, for a treat when you um, get it. So yeah, good. Best Sonic game in ages. It's my favourite Sonic, Sonic game. Best Sonic game I've as well. I, I'm a big fan well, of like pretty much majority of the Sonic games. Like, there's probably yeah. like six maybe that I don't like. Um, that's counting everything, like spin-offs. Um, mm. But this game is like my favourite out of all of them. Okay, I guess actually I'll say the ones that I don't like, and maybe Taylor you can say if you've played them before. Uh, the ones yeah. I don't like are Sonic 06, Shadow of the Hedgehog, mm -hmm. uh, Sonic Riders, um, well, all the Sonic Riders, and, um, uh, and uh, uh, what was it? Sonic Chronicles. They're the Chronicles. ones I don't like. Chronicles doesn't ring a bell. What's, what's that one? It's the RPG on DS, made by um, oh. Bioware. Bioware? Bioware? Yeah. Bioware? Yep. Okay. Ah, oh, I got crushed again. Is it me or am I the only one who is texting right now? At the moment, yeah, you're the only person messaging. Yeah. That's, that's cool. Oh my god, I got so close. I almost did it, but I was out of time. Ah. Oh. But yeah, I think he's a... He's orange with messy jobs. <gasps> I 
got a mighty continue. Oh, nice. That worm won't just be mighty, I don't think. I think it'll just like spawn you. Maybe, maybe Sonic, to be honest. But when you lose all your characters, you won't have to go back to the save so much. That's funny. Oh, look against a sword blade? You can also get um, those uh, those uh, continues in the pinball special stage as well if you get enough points. Really? Yeah. There's actually a glitch at the moment. You can just infinitely get points in that stage and just sit there mm. and get like 99 um, continues or whatever. That's a pretty good. Oh, I think I just like defeated the boss easily, the sword played one. Because you said like spike step with mighty, so I just jumped with mighty. Yeah. That's <laughs> it. What a boss. I feel the cream man. Oh, eight o'clock. Is eight o'clock? Oh my god. Yeah, the pre there. I was at nine o'clock. What? Kids won't be out at nine o'clock by my screen, are they? They don't have to go to school at the moment, so you know. Oh, that's true. They can be up at stores. They don't like past their heads, I think. Nice messaging. Crap, that's what we thought. I like this one, it's like a night time, uh, like, a tree place, I guess. Woods, but everything's like, in, in full room. Are oh, you still on press, uh, press garden, aren't you? Act 2. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I see. What is that? Is it shooting darts? Um, oh, um, those are Asterons, and you can use them as platforms. Yeah, Asterons are the um, the starfish badnets. The starfish? I just got crushed by ice. Oh, God. I just slammed myself on some ice and uh, crushed by one on top of it. I feel like it happens um, a lot as Mighty, because you can break the um, ice. Yeah, I like, smashed into it, but then there's one slightly above me. I did on my face. Ah, I but, forgot yeah. I was in super mode. Like, because Mighty oh. looks exactly the same. He does. Like when maybe he's super. A, maybe a bit orange, but. Yeah, he's like glowing, he's pretty glass. Yeah. Going too fast. What's what school? <laughs> I, I remember when I was a school. You was a school? I, t I used to be a school building once. Yeah. I went to one of those schools you could say. I love nothing. Let's actually do it properly. There we go. Oh, no. oh, I got the bonus stage. That doesn't matter though because that stops my momentum and then I'll just quit out. Oh, apparently I won't. Apparently I'll go into that. Wait, I just turn around. There we oh. go. Is this a bit cheaper? I don't think Knuckles wants to go in there. Uh, this stage actually kind of reminds me of like the last stage from um, Sonic Heroes in a way, Final Fortress. What was that? You're, you're one though. Yeah, um, the last stage in the game. Uh, I, I don't remember that one. Uh, <laughs> is, is it like Forestry one or...? Uh, it's uh, machinery. You're inside that massive, like, Death Egg robot thing. Oh, the Death Egg. The place that he always meets. His Eggman loves his eggs. And he's a big fan of Star Wars. <laughs> eggs and Star Wars, it's a weapon for everyone. Sweet, we're going to be going to the final boss, and I have my super mode. We should be able to absolutely Can you summon never? this boss. Yeah. So when you get all the seven Chaos Emeralds, if you get 50 rings, jump and then press the X button, you can just turn supersonic anytime. Oh, as sweet. long as you have 50 rings. Does it cost 50 rings? Um, so the 50 ring, as soon as you use it, the, um, if you have 50 rings or more, then you can use it. And then it counts, the timer counts down, like the rings count down. 
And when they hit zero, you lose your super form. Well, oh, so that's pretty cool. Yeah. Ooh, Thunderhawk on those rings. Oh, the secret ring. Yeah. I don't I'll even think I know where... Different. Well, actually, there's Encore mode, so it'd be yeah. different. But yeah. I'm not sure if I found one in Encore mode. Okay. It's more it's just the same level as it was in the game. It will be the same one because you found it. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's going to keep doing the first one until you beat it. That's fair enough. One more stitch into it. Almost run out of rings. Come on. It was pretty slow, though. I thought it'd be quite fast. There we go. And so, what, point a second? Ring a second? That's no. the end of Mighty's playthrough of Sonic Mania. Oh, really? <laughs> yep. Is that it? What was that, an hour? Not even that? Uh, that's probably two hours, because we started at seven and it's nine. It is. You, the addition to Sonic Mania Plus is they actually give you um, your time, how long it took you to beat it. Oh, nice. Well, that wasn't too long at all. I'm, I'm probably not halfway through, I think. I usually try to um, play through the whole story of Sonic Mania for one of the characters I do on each stream. For Sonic Forces, I've split that into two because that game's like an hour longer than Mania, I'd say. Yeah. I see you doing like twice or something like that. I've stopped at stage uh, 21, I think, and then I'm going to do the last like nine stages and maybe episode Shadow in the next Ooh. stream. Oh, sounds pretty cool. It's quite nice to get back into your like, videos. Yeah, it's, it's really it's really fun to be back. And yeah, it's been a long time, hasn't it? Yeah, it's, my last video was a random Big the Cat video that was three years old. Yeah, I remember seeing that. I was like, Big the Cat? <laughs> Why did you end on Big the Cat? Big killed my channel. <laughs> Your channel rules. Big the Cat from President. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad to do, like, be doing videos again. I prefer doing streams, to be honest. Um, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. You can interact with people more than you like. Yeah, I like interacting with the audience. And I like... Um, having to like have the whole like playthrough up like well in this case it's the whole playthrough up live in like other games cases it'll be like it'll, it, as soon as i record it if it's already out on youtube you know it makes it as yeah it, it's a bit more like, yeah you make, you, like do it edit it and do it straight away and send it yeah I, I don't mind editing videos it's just i like mm. this better to be honest i guess it's streams i have to do you you just you play you play a game that's yeah. it I, I edit the in the beginning bit, like for each video, especially this one, because I wasn't play, recording the game at the beginning. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, a, that was a little pick up the ass. I edit all of that out um, every time, because I usually like just test see if everything's working before I start up. Uh, I'm glad that you um you joined me for this stream. I actually quite enjoy co-commentating. I did... I, sorry? Yeah, it's been pretty cool actually. I quite liked it. Talking about little bits and bobs and our different views on how good Mario is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed it as well. I, I when I um like went back into it, I was kind of wanting to do like co-commentary. So if you want to join again, then I might ask you again. Um, yeah, I don't mind. It's been pretty cool. And if, um, whenever you can make it, then yeah. that'll be great. I might ask some other people as well, like, on, like, a separate stream or something, so, like, if, like, you can't make it, I'll ask, like, someone else or something, you know? Yeah, get those good people on there. Yeah. And have a good chats with everybody. <laughs> but maybe get Matt on him, Matt would love it, right? Yeah, if he wants to. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing That's... for you, Matt. Uh, um... Yeah, and uh, eventually, like, we've got a couple of playthroughs left of, oh, Matt says yes, of <laughs> um, Sonic uh, Mania. Uh, I'm gonna, like, at the moment, my, um, vid, like, my upload, well, my stream upload dates have been a bit sporadic, but I'm going to actually have a bit more of, like, a proper schedule um, at some point, probably once I've actually, like, got, like, um, a job and stuff because I've just been going for like interviews and stuff and I've got like another interview next Tuesday and I so, one, yeah it's the same one as my last one I did but they um, wanted me back because they wanted me to bring something so oh, that's good. yeah so 
They, and they seemed like they wanted me there. Well, it's more of like an apprenticeship than a job, but you still get paid, so. Yeah, still paying you a lot of experience, and it leaves like a full job. Yeah. Like a pretty good point. Yeah, they seem like very helpful, so. Seems good, like good experience. Uh, yeah. It's the year. That'd be quite good for it. And, um. So, I, I, my plan is to like have two games that I play. Um, so one on one stream, one on another stream, and then maybe like on the weekend have a game where I play just play it online for fun or something, and we'll just like continue that. So obviously I've done a lot of streams this week. I think this is my fourth one. It'll probably like four will probably be the max that I do a week to be honest. But um, cause obviously, yeah, because obviously if I've got more stuff to do, then it's gonna like take up more time. Which also makes streaming yeah, good because it doesn't take up as much time. Yeah. What was that? Sorry, you cut out. Whenever. It's just quite nice. All the plan and stuff. But you cut out. I didn't hear what you said. Oh. You can always do it whenever and stuff for stream. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Nice. I, I did like my speed run of um, Ray, like whenever I felt like it. But mm. I like, I always like to keep them at like seven ish because like. Obviously, I understand other people are working and stuff, and it's, it seems like a nice, an easier time for people to come in and watch, to be honest. And mm -hmm. I don't want it to be, I, I don't want it to be too late, because obviously, like, that's like, I, I don't want to do it too late. And yeah. um, I also want to keep it at a late enough time so people from other countries can tune in as well. That's so. true. Cause I think in America it's like what four or something like that, four or five. Yeah, yeah. So that'd be quite a good time. Yeah. yeah, I guess that was sort of like one of the best times, really. Yeah, so, and with like currently, it's been like I've managed to finish about nine Sonic Forces. I think I finished at like half eight, but I did that stream for a bit shorter than Mania because I I know I can finish the whole of Mania in one go. Is Taylor still here? <laughs> I feel like he's kind of cut out of it. <laughs> uh, anyway, we are reaching the end, so I'm going to be saying goodbye. I don't know if Taylor's still here and he can say goodbye, but I'll make sure to have Taylor with me um, as many times as he can join in, really. And um, I'm not going to do any streams so at the weekend, and I'm not going to stream on... I probably won't stream on Monday. So the next stream you probably expect will be Tuesday. So I'll see you then. And I'm going to be doing Sonic Forces, uh, finishing off the rest of the story of Sonic Forces. So stay tuned for that. And I hope you enjoyed this stream. I'm just going to keep it running until it, the credits go and then find the stream there. So thanks for tuning in and goodbye. Thank you.